Making your dream vacation a reality. Mastering English for planning getaways. Hello, language learners. Today's focus is on planning vacations and getaways. Traveling can be such a joy, but sometimes language barriers make it difficult. We're here to help you navigate these challenges and get the most out of your holiday relaxation time. The first step in planning a vacation is to learn the essential vocabulary related to travel and vacations. Here are some commonly used words and phrases. Vacation, a period spent away from home in travel or recreation. Getaway, a short vacation or trip, especially one taken as a means of escaping from routine or daily pressures. Itinerary, a planned route or journey. Destination, the place to which someone is going or something is being sent. Try using these words in sentences. For instance, I need a getaway to refresh myself, or, we have planned an exciting itinerary for our vacation. One of the most common conversational scenarios is asking and answering questions about vacations. Here are some examples. Where are you planning to go on your vacation? What is your dream destination? What's on your itinerary? Why do you want to visit there? Practice forming your responses to these questions. For instance, I am planning to go to Paris on my vacation, or my dream destination is Japan. When planning a vacation, you may need to make reservations or inquiries. This could be for flights, hotels, restaurants, or events. Here are some useful sentences to practice. Could you please tell me the price of a round-trip ticket to New York? I'd like to make a reservation for two at your hotel from the 15th to the 20th of August. Could you recommend a good restaurant near the hotel? Remember, practicing these sentences will help you feel more confident when you use them in real life. Talking about past vacations is a great way to practice your English and share your experiences. Use the past tense when discussing these vacations. For example, I visited the Grand Canyon last year. We had a wonderful time exploring the local culture. It was the best vacation I ever had. Try to share your own past vacation experiences using these sentence structures. Well, that's all for today, language explorers. Remember to practice these sentences and vocabulary words, and you'll be well on your way to planning your dream vacation in English. Can't wait to hear all about your future travels. As always, keep practicing, and we'll see you in our next video.